were cruising there way too fast and oh there's a rock and what the oh oh uh, we are about to make a speed demon this might be the fastest we've ever gone YouTube, Modal Gaming here, bringing you guys another episode of The Long Drive, and folks, we're back once again, and today, we're still searching for the red UFO. I'm getting kind of jealous of everybody messaging me on Twitter and showing me pictures of it, but if you recall last episode, we did finally catch a UFO. It was the green one, we used the physics gun. I couldn't wrestle it down and get it to where I can actually jump into it because you could supposedly drive them or ride on them. But yeah, uh, plan still stands and we're gonna upgrade our V8 motor here uh, today because this was something we found uh, last episode and it's actually something we've been searching for uh, for probably about three or four episodes. I installed the mod, I kind of forgot I had it because I couldn't find any in the world. And yeah, we finally found that last episode too. But if you guys are excited for some more long drive, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. Comment down below, what should we do next in this series? Uh, whether it be UFO hunting, uh, maybe more upgrades to the car, whatever you guys wanna see, comment down below. And uh, yeah, we'll make it happen. Man, do you hear that thing purring? That is awesome sounding. So yeah, we need to find a stop uh, with some sort of water. That way we can uh, fill up our uh, big radiator back here. And we're going to install it, and I think having a bigger radiator is going to make it a little bit more efficient because also, I'm thinking about putting some turbos and hyprozine on this just to see how it reacts to the V8 motor. Also, I forgot there's one more thing I should mention. Uh, we're searching for the stronger sandstorms. So, uh, I actually had that downloaded last episode, and the sandstorms were kind of broken. Uh, supposedly, it was a bug. I see there was an updated version. Uh, so I have it downloaded, so I'm hoping we find one. We're not in the correct biome right now, but I think I see the desert biome in the distance. But what do we have here? Uh, first stop of the day, let's hope for something good. Uh, boom. Oh. Oh, wow, look at pizza. Dude, that's perfect. That is definitely something good. Oh. Uh, oh. It's empty. It's just a pizza box. Man, who does that? All right, let's see what's in. Oh, you've got, really? I found another one? Okay, I haven't found any of these motors and all of a sudden the game's like, here, you have a V8 and then you can have another V8 and then here's another V8. Which one is this? Oh, let's read the top of it again. So this is a 5.4 liter V8. What do we have in here? This is the, oh, is this the 4.8 liter? So 5.4 is a bigger number. So in theory, we should just go yoink. Yeah, this is a 4.8, so we found a bigger V8 motor. Ha <laughs> ha, yes, more power. Actually, what does it have? Oh, it don't have oil in it. Okay, well, we need to put oil in it. Uh, we're gonna keep this V8 motor too. Uh, our back is getting really, really uh, messed up back here. Uh, we need to sort some stuff out. There's no water here, right? Well, there is a, uh, a little oil tanker down the road, so I'm pretty certain we can find the liquids we need. Uh, let's see, gas, or actually, that's just a mixture of everything. What is in here? Oil, here we go. All right, so, well, we can have a, a working V8. Uh, let's go ahead and put that into there. All right, so we just upgraded our V8. We're gonna keep this other one, too, but I'm sure the bigger number means faster. All right, I found a little bit more oil here. There we go. So there is no uh, water inside of this uh, little building, but... Uh, like I said, it's fine. There's an oil tanker. Let's go ahead and put the new engine in. We'll stick the old engine in the back. Uh, we got so much junk back here. This is fine. All right, well, we're not going to put a turbo or anything on it yet. Uh, is that going to stay? Is that actually locked down? Hold on, let's see if we can get it in the corner here. There we go. I mean, I think that's going to maybe stay. I don't know. I go flying out. But yeah, we got two turbos back here. We'll put those in here in a minute. Uh, wow. We are getting so lucky here. All right, so... Uh, no water. There's a couple things I'm gonna grab, a couple food items, but uh, it's surprisingly kind of a junky spot, except for the V8 motor. Like, everything else in here kind of sucks. All right, we're ready to go. Hopefully we have a little bit more power here. Let's crank it up. Oh, yes. I mean, I don't think there's really a difference in sound, but I'm hoping we got a little more speed now. So, question is, what other V8 motors 
are there out in the world? Dude, we are flying art. Right, watch out for rocks. Let's not die on the way out here. Okay. Look at that. Man, that power slide, though. All right, we're almost out to the uh, oil tanker here, and we should probably start slamming on the brakes here because the brakes suck on all the cars. All right, so this should be the stop that we need to find all the liquids. Uh, let's go ahead and pull right up to here. Oh, yeah, we should be able to fill up this uh, this truck. Oh, <laughs> that is 21 liters of hyprocene. <laughs> this is too much. We're going to take this. All right, so there's one barrel of stuff that we need. Uh, what else do we have in here? Uh, we have oil. Uh, we can top off our oil, but we don't necessarily need it. Actually, we could probably fill up one of the smaller containers of oil. I'm looking for just pure gas. That's the problem I'm running into here. Uh, one of these is going to have just gas in it, right? That's diesel. I've already run into two that have diesel oil. Uh, come on, give me some gas, please. All right, so the only gas barrel in here has 16 liters, which is great. I mean, it's not a full one, but... I mean, we're not going to have any issues anytime soon with gas. So let's go and open that up there. All right. And we will start to fill up our tank. Look at that. So we'll have a little over half a tank, which is plenty fine. Uh, it's really the hyprozine. Finding that much hyprozine is kind of amazing. All right. So next objective is to find water and then we will upgrade uh, the motor. Folks, look at that on the horizon. That is a sandstorm. I wonder if that's the stronger sandstorm. Uh, okay, so that's actually behind us? Wait, so maybe the sandstorm can spawn in any biome. All right, well, that's gonna take a little bit of backtracking, but I think it would, oh geez, okay, I'm spinning out. I think it'd be worth it. Like I wanna experience the sandstorms and that's the first one we've seen all day, so. I guess we're going backwards right now. It's fine. All right, sandstorm. So yeah, what happened last time? The sandstorm was like really weird looking. Like it was spread all throughout the sky and it wasn't actually pushing the vehicle. Uh, this one definitely looks a little bit more compact. Wait, where did it go? Wait, you gotta be kidding me. Did it just die on us? Wait, that's not even fair. I am really disappointed. Uh, the sandstorm disappeared. I guess it dissipated. Wow, what are the odds? We find our first one. I actually commit to going to it, and then it just poops out. <sighs> I guess there will always be more sandstorms. It's fine. All right, well, I'm a little salty about the sandstorm, but I must say the V8 motor runs great. Like, this is no upgrades. There's no turbo. There's no hyprozine in this thing right now. And look at the speed we are carrying. This is nice. All right, here we are at night. And, oh, look at that, a bus. So we have a bus stop. This is not the water we're looking for. Uh, yeah, I'm not really worried about this stop. So it is night. I'm not expecting UFOs. Uh, it seems like we're way too close to the last spotting that I don't think it's actually gonna happen, but I'm gonna definitely look out because you never know. Maybe the game's gonna say, hey, Let's throw him a curveball. Let's do two UFOs uh, within a short time period. You know, I've heard of some people saying they get too many UFOs, and I was like, wow, I'm jealous. Uh, <laughs> how can you have too many UFOs? I guess if they appeared every, like, 30 seconds, it would eventually get annoying because you couldn't make any progress. Also, so the UFO shuts off the engine, but since I have a modded V8 engine, does it still shut it off? That's actually a good question. I guess technically, were we in the car? No, we weren't actually. We were not in the car last time. We were standing outside when that UFO appeared. Hmm. I wonder. You know, I want to say probably it's going to shut off, but if it doesn't, in theory, you could stay and try to keep up with the UFO, which would be kind of cool. Tell you what, this thing runs. Oh, actually, I'm starting to die. Uh, I need to find some food. I probably have some in the back. I think there's a stop coming up, but look at how fast we run at night. Is it because the cooling's more efficient? Oh, jeez. Okay. Too fast. Too fast. Too fast. I can't see. I can't see. Okay, spin it out. Okay, we're fine. Wait, what is that? It's a red dot. Wait. Is that one of the normal red dots? I guess it is? Yeah, I think it is. I don't know. I kind of saw it and I was like, wait a minute. Red UFO, please? All right. Well, here is our next stop. We need to get something to eat. Uh, and ASAP. So here, we'll just pull right here. Have the uh, vehicle at the ready just in case. 
Uh, UFO shows up and we can chase it down. All right, what do we have here? We have a trailer, some buckets. Uh, huh, let's turn on some lights real quick. Uh, boom, there we go. Anything in here? Where's the food at? Normally there's a fridge spawned in. Oh, here's the food. Oh, never mind. <laughs> For a second there, I thought that was a croissant. That is not a croissant. That is, that's poo. Where in the heck are the liquids here? What is this? This is gas. Well, gas is good, but I need something that I can eat. All right, well, I guess we'll have to scrounge for what's in the back of the truck, which I'm sure there's food back here. Uh, there's an arm. Yeah, there's nothing like having your croissant under your arm over here. That's kind of gross. Uh, it's fine, though. We get to eat this. Also, is that poo in my back seat? I think it is. Oh, and the croissant's stuck. There we go. Hello. Beautiful. Oh, we gotta make some room real quick. Uh, we're just peeing and pooping all over ourselves. Yep, this is totally appropriate. Okay, and let's start eating the croissant. Uh, we need some water, and we need it fast. Uh-oh, we might have to eat Wilson. Uh, or is it Steve? Actually, which one's the fish? I forget my friend's names. Uh, yeah. Sorry. Yep, we just ate the fish. All right, well, uh, at least our food's good. Actually, that helped with water. All right, so we're good. Um, yeah, that's a thing. You know what? For funsies, open this up real quick. I don't have the radiator that I want yet. How much water is in this one? We could try to tran- You know what? I'm not going to transfer it. I feel like I'm going to screw that up. Uh, let's grab- This is a pretty clean looking turbo here. Can I attach it to this? <gasps> Ooh, we can. Nice. All right, so let's go- Yoink. All right, so we have a turbo on the V8. and We can always add a little hyprozine to it also. Which would be kind of fun. All right, does this thing do turbo things? That's a good question. I'm holding it wide open. I don't hear the turbo kicking on. Uh, I mean, there's a chance they're not compatible with each other. Let's let it spool up here. Come on, baby. Kick on, turbo. Oh, oh, I can hear it. It's working. Holy man. All right, this thing's going to be a total speed demon now. I mean, it was already fast enough before, but yeah, now that we've upgraded it, there's only one end, and that's gonna be death. Holy man, we are hauling right now. This is awesome. Oh, geez. Okay, hold on to it. Hold on to it. Oh, geez. <laughs> this is fine. Uh, I guess we'll, we won't use the road. The road will stay to the right. Wait, what if we hit a tree? Uh, that'd be a bad too, wouldn't it? Uh, look back. No aliens. Okay. Uh, we are good to go. Let's just keep speeding along. Man, we are gonna complete this game before you know it. Uh, question is, what's gonna be at the end? You know, they need to change it up. I heard there's nothing, but obviously maybe mom's house is out here somewhere. Uh, what do you think, uh, Wilson or, you know, Bob? Actually, I don't remember what the pumpkin's name is. Does anybody remember the pumpkin's name? Uh, comment it down below, please. Uh, okay, let's see, where's the road go? It goes to the right here. You know what's weird is, is that the power feels stable. Like, I don't feel like I'm getting those really bad random wheel spins. Uh, so, this is working. This is working really well. Uh, I feel like we have a, a really good off-roader now. Alright, just keep your foot in it, look for more buildings. Dude, we are doing it. Alright, I see our next building. We gotta shoot across the road. We're probably gonna have an epic jump here. All right, watch out for trees. Oh, watch out for rocks. Oh, geez. Okay, this is fine. Nope, that's a pole. That's a pole. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Nope, hold on to it. Oh, look at that. Ha-ha. <gasps> oh, that's a rock. Okay, spin there. On, turn it around. Boom. Totally meant to do that. Is that a gas station? Ah, it's another gas station. All right, well, uh, maybe we should stick the other turbo and put some hyprozine in it. We'll truly see how fast we can get this V8 motor. We're going to push it to the limit. Hello, beautiful. We have a sausage down here. That looks delicious. I like ground sausage. So here, we'll grab this and mmm. Yep, that's totally legit. All right, we'll uh, save the rest of this sausage for later. Okay, so what do we have in here? You know, I forgot to break open the crates on the last one. I feel like a bit of a ding dong because uh, those always have some decent loot like glasses in it. Uh, we got a croissant. We'll take that. We got some binoculars. Uh, keep looking out here. Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and upgrade this thing. Is there coolant? Nope, there's no coolant in that. Uh, what's in here? Oh, there's a fridge. I always look forward to see what's in these. Uh, it's sprung from the, uh, from GTA. Actually, we'll take this. This is good. We need liquid. There we go. Boom. All right, let's put this in the back, too. 
Yeah, I don't see any water. So I don't think we're putting the big radiator on there, but we can go ahead and throw the other turbo and the hyperzine in. Yeah, buddy. All right, grab the other turbo. It's another big boy turbo, so these should match up pretty good. Let's attach. All right, that one's spinning. Uh, all right, can confirm turbo is good. Hold on, when we shut it, it's going to poke through the hood. That actually kind of looks cool, not going to lie. All right, so we got that. Let's get our hyperzine. Uh, we are about to make a speed demon. This might be the fastest we've ever gone. All right, here we go. Hyperzine mix. I want to say it's 20%. Uh, a little bit more and boom, 20% hyperzine. Oh, we are ready to fly. All right, so I don't know if all this stuff's... Oh, it does get along together. Okay. Is this fine? Yep, there is definitely some speed here. Just a little bit. It's, it's going to be okay. We're going to be able to handle this. Also, we're heading out to the desert, so we'll be out there in no time. Oh, dear. Okay, this is fine. <laughs> oh, when I say this is fine, normally it's not fine, but... This is okay. We'll just call it okay. So we're going to head out to the desert. Let's hope we can find one of those super sandstorms today because i want to go through one i'm curious uh at least we can get there in no time so you guys want to hear a funny story komodo wasn't paying attention and checking his phone in real life um i might have crashed <laughs> okay so it is definitely fast it might be too fast hold on we got wheels uh i think we're gonna make it here all right, so let's put this wheel here. It's a, I don't know how we didn't die. Wait, what was that? What was that? You see that shimmer there when I look down? Uh, there was a shimmer in that building. Maybe it's a physics gun? Hold on, also look around. Do we see a sandstorm? Uh, nope. All right, well, let's put the wheels back on. Oh, nope, I didn't want to do that. Yeah, this thing completely fell apart. Uh, but luckily everything landed like kind of in the same area, which is nice. I hit this uh, tree. Uh, let's put that back on. Yeah, somehow we didn't die. It's got to be because I uh, ate all that food. Hey, no, Mr. Rabbit. I need this back. Uh, we got to take this. We have sandstorms to find. There we go. And up oh, on. Get back on here. We're going to make this as good as new. Uh, oh, we're working on it. Boom. There we go. All right. We got a working vehicle again. Uh, we got a little blood on the dash, but we can always wipe that off. It's fine. All right, let's keep moving. All right, so I got a bit of a plan. It looks like the road potentially kind of go... Oh, that's a building. Yeah, the road goes to the left, and I'm going to make a detour. I saw a green light again. What am I seeing? It's got to be something to do with the skybox and how it lights up at night. But yeah, I was seeing green in this building. I want to say either it's the skybox doing something weird, or maybe there's a physics gun in here. Which, you know, somebody was pointing out the whole fact that I missed a physics gun the other day. And I was like, I already have one. So why would I get the physics gun that is over here? Also, is that purple? What color is this? Uh, spray the car. Ooh. That's actually good looking. I like that. Boom. All right. So I'm going to keep the doors uh, and the hood blue, though. I like that two-tone. So, yeah, we're going to head towards the desert. As you can see, the road, it curves to the left, and I'm sure it goes that way. Which, I mean, it's not going to be a big detour, but desert biome. Sandstorms. we got to find them. By the way, the back of my vehicle is starting to look like the Beverly Hillbillies. Like, we have so much stuff piled back there. Uh, this is fine. All right, let's head out into the unknown. Let's go see if we can find ourselves a sandstorm. Folks, we are moving at, like, super speed right now. Like, we're moving at a speed that the stuff loading in can barely keep up. So if they load in, like, a big rock in front of me, we're going to go flying. Uh, there's nothing I can do about this, though, besides going slower. But <laughs> who likes to do that? So, yeah, still on the search for sandstorms. It's kind of weird. We've been cruising around in the desert biome for a little bit. And I haven't seen anything, so I'm hoping we're going to get lucky here really soon. And one's going to appear on the horizon, but we'll be able to see what a super sandstorm is like. All right, we're cruising there way too fast, and oh, there's a rock and what the... Oh, on, land... Oh, okay. You've got to give me some style points for that. We landed that. That was awesome! Hey, look at this. There's a tower stop out here. Oh, don't die, don't die, don't die. Okay, brakes, 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 brakes. Uh, wow, we're just so far away from the road. Uh, and you've got this random thing out here. Also, there's a tower over there. Nice. 
All right, well, I'm going to search this out real quick just to see if we can find something. I think we can put the big radiator in now because I'm almost 100% certain there's going to be a fountain in here, which is great. What is that? Is that a birthday cake? <gasps> hey, happy birthday to me. Nice. All right, let's stick this in the back too. Uh, so we'll get a good view, see if we can find a sandstorm. Uh, we need this. All right, well, let's go ahead. We got water in here. Let's go ahead and start that up real quick. There we go. All right, uh, open this up here. All right, let's fill this full of coolant real quick. There we go. All right, so here's a good question. Will this sit in here? Uh, we want the most efficient cooling ever. So here, let's dismount this. And then, come on, yoink, look at that. All right, we'll keep our old uh, little cooling tank here. Boom, and let's we'll slap the hood back on it. This thing's gonna look pretty awesome. Uh -huh. Flip it around. Come on, get back on there. There we go. Look at our upgraded ride. This thing's sweet. Also, by the way, you're going to notice that it's not purple. Uh, I had to reset once or twice. It's fine. Uh, but, yeah. Let me see if I can find it. Oh, there we go. This was meant to be, folks. Uh, boom. Yeah, Komodo's uh, been pretty good at dying out here in the desert. But, say, you know, if we die and we bleed on our car, we now have blood red. So it's like you won't even notice the difference. That actually looks kind of cool. Oh yeah, look at that upgraded beast. But I've got to go search for uh, some sort of super sandstorm. Uh, hopefully we'll find it maybe by next episode, but we did pretty good today. We got a new V8 motor we've upgraded. It's got turbos, hyperzine, and a big old coolant tank. This thing is ready to rock. So if you guys have any suggestions, comment down below and we'll see you guys next time.